What's up, YouTube? <clears throat> I'm Z, and this channel shows you the world through my lens. So this was requested on my live uh, the other day, and uh, I want to do it. Uh, there's so many things that have been requested. Trust me, guys, I see all the stuff that you're saying. It's just that some of the stuff that you guys are asking for, uh, like Coachella, um, I would need a good chunk of time to sit down. It's currently 1 a.m. And this is because with the current situation, with my family life, with my home life, the only time I can record is when everyone else has gone to sleep. Um, it's just a situation I'm stuck in right now. So the reality is like I can't really do super long reactions. Plus, the issue with Beyonce stuff is that it's all getting tagged. Um, sad, sad news because we go back and uh whoops oh no it just pulled up the one i wanted to show you guys all of them but uh yeah we got uh we got some bad news here team so let's scroll down and uh the lemonade film has officially been taken down i got an email last night uh, and the email basically said uh, that my dispute has been officially rejected. So you can see that here, dispute rejected. I'm not sure if you guys can see that very well. Hold on, let me let me maybe do this. Might be easier to see. Uh, but uh, yeah, so here, dispute rejected. Uh, and I was informed in the email that they have officially taken my video down. So it is blocked worldwide, not available. We did manage to get 21,000 views before that happened, 200 comments. Uh, this is not bad, like, you know, 98.9% .9 like rate. Uh, I feel really good about that. There are 14 people who didn't like my opinion, um, and that's okay. Not everyone needs to like me, but uh, sad moment because I was getting really good comments and feedback from people on this. So um, I'm worried, man. I'm worried that, like... The rest of this is just a matter of time before it gets taken down, you know. Um, we'll see. We'll see how it goes. I hope uh, I hope that isn't the case, but, you know, what are you going to do, right? So um, let's go back here and uh, check this out. Just so you guys know, right before I did this, I listened to I Was Here on uh Spotify on my phone and uh I've heard the song now so now I'm gonna check out the the live here. Nice message. I like the stage. Goosebumps right now. Goosebumps. The backdrop. I wanna say I lived each day until I died. And know that I had something in somebody's life. The hearts I have touched would be the proof that I leave. That I made a difference. And this world will see I was here. I 
did I've done everything that I wanted And it was more than I thought it would be Now we all leave my mark So everyone will know time like not being emotional right now the 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 tingly feeling all over my body has been like for the last two and a half minutes (laughs) yeah like basically from when she started singing um and and the visuals in the back are making it really hard i think anytime i see kids uh especially now that i'm a dad i think it really tugs at my heartstrings i'm gonna stop talking because i can feel myself uh, wanting to get more emotional. We're going to let it go out. A little better just because I was here. I was here. I lived. I loved. I was here. I did. I've got everything. of that song are so powerful her live rendition of it uh, there was moments where she was almost accompanying herself uh, which was a little different than like the recorded version Um, but mostly what stands out like the lyrics are powerful matches the the theme of this uh, humanitarian day um the video playing in the back like the the pop-up saying i was here like each of those people that were volunteering to risk their lives their time their whatever to help other people um that's their mark on the world like the way the lyrics fit with the with the theme of what was happening here but mostly when she went into like power mode and you felt like there was a moment where you see her and her eyes kind of looked watery. Um, it made it really hard. It made it really hard not to also feel like, first of all, I was just feeling tingly, like top to bottom. <laughs> like that was nonstop. Just goosebump after goosebump after goosebump. But uh, it was very hard to not feel emotional with that video playing and her powerful, powerful voice. Like when you hear a powerful voice like that singing so beautifully, I think it just draws emotion out in a really powerful way um i don't really think i'm adding anything of value here i just feel like i'm trying to process my emotions in this moment because i think that did make me feel very emotional uh if you guys are still here i appreciate you spending your time with me i really hope this doesn't get blocked 
Uh, but I hope you have an awesome day, and I will see you next time.